As an administrator of an ArcGIS Online organization, your first task, after you've activated the subscription, is to configure the website to fit your organization's brand and needs. This can include uploading a logo, adding a description, choosing a background image and banner for the homepage, and making security settings. This video focuses on the settings that administrators can edit at any time from the My Organization page. The general settings for the site include the site name, logo, description, language, and region. For the home page, you can display your own banner, either from an image or by entering your own custom HTML. Featured content typically contains the web maps and applications your organization wants to promote. Collect up to 12 items into a group that you then choose as your featured content group. You can also choose not to feature any content on the home page. Like featured content on the home page, your gallery consists of content you've collected into a group. To populate all three galleries, be sure your group has maps, web applications, and mobile applications. The map can use your organization's authoritative base maps and templates and be configured to use a default base map at a specific extent. You can also enable Bing Maps to use in your web maps if your organization has a Bing Maps key. The Item Details configuration allows you to control whether comments appear on your organization's item details. For groups, you can select which groups to feature on your site's groups and My Organization pages and which templates to use for creating group gallery applications. Configure utility services if you have a custom print service you want to use for printing web maps with your own layouts. Within the security section, you determine whether SSL is required for all transactions, whether anonymous access is allowed, and whether sharing and searching are allowed outside the organization. You can also set up enterprise logins to allow your organization's members to log into ArcGIS Online using the same logins they use to access your enterprise information systems. When you're done configuring your site, be sure to save your settings.